हेलो गाइस वेलकम टू माय चैनल टुडे इन एन एंड्रॉइड लर्निंग सीरीज वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न व्हाट इज सर्विसेज लाइफ साइकिल ऑफ सर्विसेज बाउंड सर्विसेज एंड नॉर्मल सर्विसेज एंड वन बाय वन वी विल मेक ए प्रोग्राम ऑफ ऑल दीज थिंग्स टू अंडरस्टैंड इट प्रैक्टिकली आल्सो सो लेट अंडरस्टैंड व्हाट इज सर्विसेज इन एंड्रॉइड ए सर्विसेज इज एन एप्लीकेशन कंपोनेंट that can perform long running operation in the background and does not provide a user interface that means service do not have any user interface just like a activity having a screen so services does not have any kind of a screen and we need services when we want to perform a background task that will take long amount of time means it will take more than 5 second of time or maybe long suppose we are downloading a some file we are playing a some music so on that time we require the application that do not have a interface but it should have a long running task in the background so for that purpose we need a services then what are the service good for service can be used for network transactions service can be used for playing music service can be used for performing any io operations and interaction with the content provider means whenever we require a long time in a background then we need services in services uh, start with the intent and uh, can stay running whenever you just switch application means when you switch your application you close your application still your service run service having a life cycle service needs some permissions for running their background tasks and uh, service is also part of main th thread means the activity which is starting a service is that thread is also is like a service thread means service do not run in separate thread service run on a same thread in main in which your main activity run so this is the life cycle of normal services whenever we click on start services it run then after starting a services it function call on create in on create we initialize all the objects whatever we required then on start command method call and after that we call service is run service is starting after on start command and whenever we click on destroy is yes, your stop services or self stop self method then automatically this particular service stop and function call on destroy so after destroying then we have to restart the services so once the service start it automatically runs in the background if there is a bound services then in bound services there is something change what does change in place of a start services we use bind services method in place of a stop services we use unbind services method and after on create method we have a on bind method in place of on start command then we bound that particular service with a application or activity or other services or content provider then it is still run in a background interact with the applications or activity in which we bound the services then we have to call unbind method unbind method will unbound the service from the link activity then it call on destroy method and its services stop so this is all about the services of normal uh, normal services life cycle and bound service bound service life cycle now we see the example of first in which we will learn how to create how to display the use of life cycle of activity of services then we will make one program of normal services and then later on we will make a program of bind services so now we are using the we are showing the life cycle of services so first of all we put a math button for starting a services and stopping a services so we are dragging dropping a button and then we touch this on the screen also because it's a constant layout then one more method for stopping a services
and we'll link this with the upper bit. Okay, now we make some changes. We make the name of this button start services. and start service and we also have to set the size it should be 30 dp and then we also change here name stop services here button to name should be stop services okay we can change the size also if we see this now it is start services and stop services we can also change the width and it also say so start services is stop services now we need to create a service so right click on app go to new then go to services create new services name of this is my services then this is the service that is my service and is extended by the service class so we have to give example of life cycle of services so we have to override some method first method is on create so this method first method we are overriding then we have to override on a start on a start then we have to call on destroy so these three methods we have to override for showing the life cycle of the services for here we are creating a one constant value tag name my service log so in create we put log dot i put uh, tag name then the text which we want, want to display alt enter then we display I am in on create method. Same kind of thing I have to display in on a start and then sorry after. this return value before the return value and here we put I am in on start command method then we have to paste here and copy and paste here we have to tell I am I am in on destroy method. So, like this, uh, we are making this. Now we have to open locket.
and here we have to search the information and name of the information is my service log because i have given the name here my service log so information regarding this will display here when i will run this program so click on this and we start to run but one more thing is remaining still we are not uh, start the services because the service is ready right now service is ready but we have to start and stop the services to run this method so we have to link here also with button so first of all we have to create the button start service and stop service button we have to create first of all then start service equal to find by view id r dot id dot btn start service and then stop service sorry stop service stop service stop service dot sorry equal to find view by id r dot id dot stop service now we have to start the services for event handling so this is start s t a r t set on click listener new on click listener then we have to start the services and uh, for a starting a services what we have to do we have to create an intent first so we are creating an intent i and alt enter and we have to create i equal to new intent then main activity dot this then my service dot class because we want to run this services from the intent we have to call function start services first of all we have to close it start services and here we have to put i then we have to make another event handling for stop services set on click listener new on click listener and here we have to call stop services and i we have to pass here same intent we have to pass for stopping a services this i here here now program is ready we have to run it and check the life cycle in this now you see program is ready when i click on this start services it will run on a start command method and stop it on destroy again start then on create method then on a start method and when i click on stop services on destroy method so like this it starting on create on a start on destroy once again if you see i clear it and i run this again you see start services then on create method first of all then on start method when i stop then on destroy method 
so this is all about the sir, life cycle of services see you again in next program in which we will learn how to play background music in services